Some people are already gathering here at Riverfront Park. They want a front row seat when they bring this 6,000 pound anchor back to the surface, back to life, if you will, trying to bring a little bit of Detroit's old nautical history to life for future generations. If water could talk, it'd tell quite the story of what's beneath these choppy waters. Directly beneath this buoy lies a ship anchor frozen in time for six decades. But its history stretches even further back. So it's an extremely, you know, boom time, the roaring 20s kind of thing. William Warden, a local historian of sorts, came to witness the resurrection of one of Detroit's long hidden treasures. I was a kid when the boats were sitting idle. One of those boats, the one the anchor belonged to, was the steamship Greater Detroit, a modern marvel in the 20s. In its heyday, this ship was considered a floating palace. If the pictures don't do this thing justice, imagine that it's as long as a 56-story building is tall. More than 2,000 people could ride it in luxury, with room for an extra 103 vehicles to boot. So why the work to bring up the anchor now? Well, the ship was burned and scrapped in the 1950s, but as Warden reminds us, Detroit is home to more than just the auto industry. These waters and Detroit was once home to one of the greatest naval architects that ever lived. Anything that reminds us that we have that distinction, even if it's a small thing, is a worthwhile endeavor. And I can tell you they've already had some setbacks. They were supposed to actually have the barge out here about an hour ago, but those who came out, and they say they are in high spirits. They want to see this thing brought back to the surface. And they say part of the reason they've had the delays, well, they do have to count on volunteers. And that's a good reminder. They're looking for donations so they can get this display off the ground so more people can see this anchor once it's brought back to the surface in all its glory. We have information on how you can help out at WXYZ.com. For the Now Detroit, I'm Matthew Smith. All right, Matthew, thank you so much. By the way, we have a live picture right now from the choppers. You can see right now it is over that barge. It is in place. There is at least one diver in the water right now down there with that anchor, and they're going to be bringing it up very shortly. We'll keep an eye for you uh, on it and have uh, the pictures for you as soon as we get them in here. Yeah, cool.